welcome back friends today in this video i will show you that how to use vacutainer needle venous blood collection needle for multi samples if we have to collect then how we will use vacutainers <clears throat> these are uh, black cover vacutainer there are two types black and green coming difference in the needle the black one now i am showing you the needle is 22 gauge and that other one i show you that is the holder and we can take more tubes how much we want we can collect sample otherwise if you have syringe only only one particular amount like 5 ml 3 cc or 10 cc like that you can take blood only but with the help of vacutainer we can collect more blood what else other items we need we need spot bandage alcohol swab if alcohol swab not available you can use spirit cotton bud sharp container to discard the vacutainer needles and the holder we can it's your choice if you have more holders you can discard otherwise this holder is multi purpose you can use again but if it become dirty must have to clean uh you can clean with sodium hypochlorite dilution diluted water and then general ways to discard the covers of alcohol swab or uh, uh, spot bandage and for cotton you will discard in yellow sharp container now you will just pull this and it will open now this black rod rubber point you will insert inside carefully insert because in that rubber there is the needle so like that you will close and tight now you put the tourniquet and tell the patient to keep his arm straight and fist little close and then just locate the vein once you will locate the vein then you just clean the vein with alcohol swab like clockwise position and then just let it dry for few seconds only after that keep ready vacutainer needle and uh, your tubes for sample collection now we will remove the cover of vacutainer and we will take the first sample according to blood draw order we will take serum sample first and just insert the needle and then at this point where arrow is showing you have to maintain your pressure so that needle should not come out otherwise the one mistake we will do when we will insert the sample tube mostly this pressure here we will not focus and needle will come out so inserting the syringe sorry when you will insert the sample tube you have to maintain your pressure and when you will remove it's easy to remove then again keep your pressure maintain and insert the second tube like that one benefit now you will see according to the vacuum in the tubes automatically blood will come and when this vacuum will finish blood will stop that time you can withdraw the tube now this is the last tube we will take the sample when it will be near to complete or complete just open the tourniquet remove the sample tube and then just keep the cotton and remove carefully vacutainer needle then with the use of one hand only put the cover of the needle and then again you can remove the needle like that anti clockwise you will move and it will remove and discard in the sharp container and holder you can keep in the box because this holder we can use but needle should be one time use needle we cannot use for multi purpose remove the cotton put the spot bandage and cotton we will discard in infected ways now you see like that we will collect the our samples <clears throat> 